Good evening from Exciting Road Viewpoints, where we talk about aspects of science fiction and many other other things in the world of space, science fiction, and adventure. Today, we're going to continue more about the science and genre of science fiction, where we talk about Star Trek, and we're going to focus on a series called Star Trek Continues. So first of all, you all have been very good fans the last little while in supporting this channel, and I see that you all enjoy the episodes of, I've been doing reviews of Star, the series, Star Trek Continues, which was, I, in my opinion, an independent studio production versus the same as a production. So therefore, I'm going to continue on with the other episodes, reviews of Star Trek Continues, and we're going to talk about the episode called Come Not Between the Dragons. And this is actually the sixth episode of Star Trek Continues. So Come Not Between the Dragons, uh, directed by Julian Higgins, air date May 28, 2016. The top five cast members, I put them on the screen for you here. So Star Trek Continues episode Come Not Between the Dragons. It dives deep into the moral and philosophical complexities that define Star Trek branches, presenting an original story with a unique alien counter that raises questions about family, fear, and empathy. So the episode features some strong performances and very good makeup work, and the production quality is something that even Star Trek, Star Trek continues, continues to strive for. So this is basically a fan-driven series, as I mentioned before, as I call it an independent funded production, and it's always on the modest budget. The high quality episodes captured the spirit of the original show. The recreation of the Enterprise Bridge and the makeup and the uniforms and the costumes are right bang on to which the original series was all about. So this episode showcased the ability of balancing action and drama while exploring complex themes. Sets, light, and design are all very impressive throughout the whole time. So the story sum summary, come not between the dragons, the Enterprise crew encounters a massive rock log creature known as the beast that seems to be drawn to the ship. We soon discover that this creature is pursuing a younger member of the species, dragon-like alien called Eli. Now, it is played by, as I mentioned, the actor on the screen. His crew member forms a, a good connection with Eli, learning about the fears and struggles that he seeks to escape from his abusive parent. Kirk, Spock, and McCoy struggle to understand this alien being and its motives ultimately realize that they have stumbled into a familial conflict between two members of a powerful alien species. As they work to protect Eli from the beast, they are forced to confront difficult questions about autonomy, fear, and compassion. Episodes emphasizes on empathy and family, exploring how we miss understandings and cumulative breakdowns can escalate into violence. In the Star Trek, Star Trek fashion, the crew of the Enterprise takes a compassionate approach striving to understand the aliens and the enemy for conflict, rather than resorting to violence. It is a refreshing uh, reminder of what Star Trek calls stands for exploration and the power of understanding. The quality of the storytelling, main cast delivers a strong performances, all the reads good uh, efforts in all the, the characters' roles. Uh, the main, main actors that the story evolved from is, is very helpful and end up scoring and underscoring the actual scenes of compassion. Her scenes with Eli are particularly powerful and she provides a sense of checkness and understanding that is both touching and believable. The writing is top-notch, story is constructed, explores complex and emotional dynamics between the alien characters. The show's title, inspired by Shakespeare, hints at the tension between family members and danger, danger of interfering in other conflicts. The episode features an original storyline that feels fresh, yet it remains true to the spirit of Star Trek, focusing on ethical dilemmas and moral choices. The visual effects are very impressive, creating a believable alien character that fits seamlessly in the world of Star Trek. Eli's appearance is both striking and sympathetic with all the detailed makeup. The episode has impressive visual effects, creatures, interactions, crew, and with even the limited budget, the production team had managed to have fall high quality effects to enhance the story without overshadowing the characters. Reception, Come Not Between the Dragons, has lots of positive feedback from fans and critics. Praise the episode for being original, good promoting themes. Themes highlight the strong acting by the guest performance. Fans of Star Trek, Star Trek continues. Appreciate the series commitment to capturing the essence of original Star Trek, while also exploring creative storylines. Episode 
came by for the exploration of empathy, empathy and understanding. That's what Star Trek is so enduring. Sponsor fan was always overwhelming. So this is why I like the episode. I found the episode to be a powerful episode. Original Star Time, a focus on empathy and compassion, presents a good alien encounter that goes beyond simple conflict, dynamics between family members, and the of understanding perspectives. Episode's writing is thoughtful and layered, and the character's interaction are very provoking. This is a perfect example of how Star Trek continues Use the science fiction to explore meaningful themes while making it very entertaining for the audience. Final thoughts? Thank you for joining me in review of Come Not Between the Dragons with Star Trek Continues. Thank you. Hope you enjoyed this moment of exciting rural viewpoints. And now it's your turn. Tell me your thoughts on this episode, Come Not Between the Dragons. What were your best points and what were the negative points you thought about their episode? So tell me and leave the answers in below and we can have a really good review and discussion further on. So thank you for your time, and you have yourself a great day. Bye for now.